Only on two tonight, a North Shore school board member and mom to a teenage boy has now been identified as the bicyclist killed in a Highland Park hit and run. Police are still searching for the driver who took off. CBS 2's Marissa Perlman live for us at the school district and as that district comes to grips with what they call a tragic loss. Marissa. Well, Joe Highland Park Police asking for any information that could help them track down who hit and killed 49 year old Maureen Wenner. Her husband tells us not many people get to choose how they pass, but his wife died doing what she loved. A small memorial at Piccadilly and Deerfield Roads in Highland Park, where Maureen Wenner was killed at just 49 in a hit and run Friday afternoon. The driver took off. We're told Good Samaritans rushed over to help. We had actually just been talking last week about how she loved to ride her bike and how she rode it everywhere and um, just, you know, it's still very surreal. A true public servant, Wenner served on several local boards, including the Deerfield Public Library and District 109 on the Board of Education. That's where she met President Sari Montgomery. She really um, was dedicated to this community. It sounds um, idealistic, but she really wanted to make the world a better place. We spoke with Wenner's husband, Paul, by phone, who sent these photos of his wife and their son, Keegan, just 13, on a recent trip to Universal Studios. This was their last vacation together. Lovers of travel, the couple was about to celebrate 20 years together. The day before she was killed, Wenner was handing out diplomas alongside Superintendent Mike Simic. She gave a diploma to half of the graduates of the eighth grade class from one of our middle schools and then a day later you're writing to the community about tragic loss. Simic calls his colleague small but mighty who loved giving back. For me the, the sentiment overwhelmingly is just extraordinary sadness and loss. You don't realize how much you care about somebody until they're suddenly gone. She's the, the gem of a person. Well, Maureen Wenner's funeral is tomorrow. Family tells us as many as 500 people are expected to show up to support this family. In the meantime, Highland Park Police have not provided a description of the vehicle. So far, no one has been arrested. We're live in Highland Park tonight. Marissa Perlman, CBS 2 News. Joe? Yeah, it sounds like she will be sorely missed for sure. Marissa, thank you very much.